told you, I hope it's not it's not about the more wars. Um <laughs> well, one more is about a war. Um, Here, go ahead. It must be a oh. really war, huh? No, it's Vietnam. Um all right. Did you know? Not that old. They are Vietnam. <laughs> did, did you know anyone who served or died in the war, or are there any stories? Which war? The Vietnam. No. Oh. Sorry about that. Well, I had to ask for the camera. So I can look back. So. Alrighty then. Um, so um, he served yeah, in the Roscoe, Vietnam. Uh, uh, Roscoe served in it. Do you know how long he served it? Mm, breathe. Um, what did you think about the counterculture, rock, rock and roll, and the youth culture during the 60s? Hmm. Well, at least I think it's a little better than what it is today. Yeah, I think so too. Um, Dead? Um Describe the civil rights movement from your perspective. What kind of impact did it have on America? The civil rights mm-hmm. movement? Well, we can go into different stores now. We can go to different restaurants. Go into some school, although it's still a little just uh, discrimination uh, uh, among us. But uh, it's a little better than what it was in that. <laughs> Describe the civil rights movement from your perspective. It was in a uh, it was a, a great awakening to uh, the, the conditions in the United States. Um, did you get excited about the race to the moon? The race to the moon? No, I didn't get no. excited. I don't know whether it went up here or not. <laughs> 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 Alrighty, um, how, yeah, okay. how did, <laughs> 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 um, how, <coughs> so you didn't ask him, I'm just that's what I was saying, okay, um, how did the assassinations of Martin Luther King and Robert Kennedy affect you? Martin Luther King affected me because um, he was trying to do something for the black people, which the other people didn't want to happen. Yeah, I saw that. I'm sorry that they killed him. How did the assassinations of Martin Luther King and JFK affect you? Well, it made me mad. When he really shot Martin Luther King, it made me mad. But the, uh, uh, the that's it. And that was the truth. <laughs> <laughs> no, it wasn't true. It was the truth. How has America <clears throat> how has America changed the most since you were a young adult? Since I was a young adult. Since I was a young adult. I had to change. The ports of living had to go up. Places, man. Mm-hmm. Um, 
that I have read about, I'm a little freer than some of the people. At least I'm not going hungry. There's some different things that happen in America than happen overseas. The best country in the world. Anything specific? Anything specific? <laughs> it's just, it's just the, the best country in the world. I've, I've been halfway around the world. <laughs> it's, the, it's the best country in the world. Okay. Um, what has changed about America since you were a child? Didn't you ask that? No, the other one since you were a younger, well, since you. Young adult. That's the same thing. Um, what do you hope America will become during your grandchildren's or my lifetime? <laughs> Hopefully, become a true democracy, so everyone can be truly equal. Mm -hmm. Same thing. <laughs> Same thing. You got more? No, that's it. Mm -hmm. that's it. Thank you for your time, people. I know it was kind of. I boring. thought you said it was ten more. Five, five more. When I was at twenty-two, it was ten more. Oh, okay, five so more minutes. Yeah, she didn't get enough. <laughs> Don't squeeze them more out of it. <laughs> it really squeezed the day. Okay, we're, we're done. You can. Okay. Cut. All right. 